In this video, what I'm going to do is just give a quick tutorial of how to at least give the illusion of embedding your YouTube videos in Craigslist. Actually, I wrote a Bigger Pockets article about this um, back in the fall of last year. Then I log into Facebook today, and Lawrence, he asked, you know, can you just do a quick little demonstration video? So I'm up for it, and plus I actually need to post a video on, I need to repost the Craigslist ad anyway. So first thing you do is, um, of course, get your ad together, depending on if you're going to use a postlet um, ad or not. I'll just do this this instructional video without it just for the sake of simplicity and um, so you get your, your text of your ad together next thing you do you go to your YouTube video and you'll need to take a screenshot of the actual window so um, what I use for my screenshots I use a Firefox plugin see it here in the upper left hand corner it's called Fireshot and so what I do is I come down here and I usually just capture the entire page and then select edit and so I crop it and then upload it through Fireshot to the Fireshot has its own like hosting for images so I will go through that now except it will mess up this recording so I've already done it and so once you upload it to Fireshot this actually isn't the best image, but once you up, once you crop it, and then select to upload it to Fireshot, it'll ask you to give a title and description. All that really isn't that necessary, um, like the description and the tags or whatnot, because all you want is just to host the image. If you if you want to use this site as uh, as people use Flickr then you probably want to do all the description and tags and stuff but we're not looking for web optimization of the image we just want to host it so now I got it hosted there and then it will give me it will give me the embed options for for a blog or whatever website you want to put it to so what we want to do is you want to get the image but yet make you want the link for the image to be to your YouTube page and so this just requires just a little minor understanding of HTML so what you do I just copied that embed code by the way we come back over to Craigslist and I'm gonna paste it here so href what this means is let's see how do I describe okay what this means is this image right here is the source and once one clicks on it it's gonna go to this link and then actually this stuff this is actually on the bottom here this is just a link for easy captures which we don't need you can take that out I think um, everything after here we can take out technically so that's all we need it's pretty simple this is the image no this is the image this is the link so what we want to do is in between those two double quotes we want to put the link for YouTube video. And actually, I don't want this property, I want this property. So, pause that. So, what I want is this right here this URL. We go back to Craigslist, go back to the H A H ref and paste that in. Actually I feel like I'm missing something. 
A H R F. Uh, nope. I think that's all I need. So that's it. Then click continue. Here we go. See, here it's not a hyperlink. Here's a hyperlink. So now when you click on that, it takes the user to YouTube. So we'll go back. Go back to Craigslist real quick. You can actually set it to, sh to pop up in a new window if you want. But, uh, you know, um, for the sake of keeping this short, I won't go through all that. And then you just go continue and, uh, you know, do the capture stuff, and that's it. By the way, if you want to learn more about HTML, w3schools.com is a great resource. So w3schools.com that's plural schools and uh, just go to the HTML link and it kind of gives you just real quick information about uh, HTML. So that's it.